A literature review is similar to a dialogue on a specific topic between authors. Its purpose is to convey to your reader what has been argued or established about this topic. More so, the purpose of the literature review is to highlight the strengths and weaknesses of such debates guided by your particular thesis or point of view on the issue. As such, the literature review is not simply a descriptive piece of work. The literature review demonstrates your knowledge base and grasp of the subject at hand, as well as your ability to effectively scan the literature efficiently. It should also demonstrate your ability to critically appraise, applying principles of analysis, and to identify types of studies. Thus, the literature review must have the following. It should have organization developed around your thesis, a synthesization of ideas or arguments into a summary of what is and what is not acknowledged within the relevant literature. It should also highlight to the reader issues of controversy and develop questions that need further research from the issues and information that have been presented. So your literature review should be asking, you should ask yourself, uh, what is the thesis and problem or research question that your literature review is addressing? While re re reading each work for your literature review, you need to establish some key research points, such as how, what, and why the author presents the debate. As a discursive piece of work, the literature review must be clear on the type of review being conducted, as well as its scope. In other words, are you taking into consideration the theoretical, method methodological, or some other aspect of the research? Are you analyzing qualitative or quantitative research? And what types of texts or sources are you including, or, and what are you excluding? Are you only looking at articles, academic books, or media-based sources? And do you have a time-related limit for your sources? Are you only taking into consideration very recent literature or a different time frame, and why? Critical analysis is crucial for the literature review, and you must be able to determine and explain what literature is relevant and irrelevant. It is also useful to mention sources that run contrary to your thesis and explain the reasons for this contradiction. Overall, you want to ask yourself whether or not your reader will find your literature review useful and relevant, giving them the larger picture of the debate that you are addressing. Finally, literature reviews can be short or long pieces of work, depending on what your purpose is for this review, and can be useful for many purposes, as I have mentioned. Good luck. Take care.